September is a great month to be buying some cryptos, in my opinion. Now, before we get into it, I'm the finance advisor. I do some education. Now, I'm about to tell you the two cryptos you should be buying this December, what's happening in the markets, and change it up a bit by saying, I want you to understand why you should be buying this right now. So let's get straight in. As always with the market, start off with Bitcoin. Bitcoin is the driving factor to what happens in crypto. And as we can see, it's been going down. You don't need me to come on a YouTube video and tell you Bitcoin's going down. We know it is, okay? That's not something special. What I want to tell you is it's as low as we can go. And people are going to be on this saying, it's crazy, it's going to go lower. There is people like Gemini who are going under. We're trying to recover 900 million from crypto lenders. This has a big effect on crypto. But guess what? Only 3% of the Bitcoin market moved for this. That shows me that we are too low to even drop. F FTX, one of the biggest in the space, goes from amazing millionaire company to nothing. Okay, the owner literally went from being nearly a billionaire to now not even owning $10,000. And guess what? It didn't even change more than 4% of the Bitcoin market. That tells me we are at the lowest possible because back in the day when things would happen, Bitcoin, if you go to the all time, all right, things like this, these drops would happen with market news, things that were happening, whether it was the war going on, whether it was the queen dying, things like that. Now we don't even move. We are at the lowest you can get. So now is the time to start get invested in bitcoin that's my opinion and that's why i'm bringing it to you so let's get straight in anyway that's how this market is moving i want to tell you today about the two cryptos that i think you should be buying in december 2022 now i want to talk to you about fed pivot all right now it doesn't mean the bottom is in either but what fed pivot does as you can see by this chart the majority of the decline in these bear markets occurred after the fed's pivot now that's the federal funds effective rate they're actually affecting through the years as you can see at the bottom here as tweeted by jmo trades all right from 1970s all the way through to 2020s the fed pivot is the one that affects the most of any market now this is the s p 500 index isn't even the crypto but as you can see from the way this works everything falls down onto the crypto markets what exactly is the fed pivot okay the fed has two jobs keeping prices stable maximum employment adjustments to how the fed actually achieves both goals move likes adjusted interest rates and buying bonds back all right when the central bank slashes interest rate it adopting expansionary of loose monetary policy so why is the fed raising interest rates so during the pandemic which is one of the biggest market movers okay the shutdown 2022 the fed actually reduced the fed runs rate to zero preventing a total economic catastrophe all right a combination of the pandemic related supply chain distributions pent up consumer again guys go on to this article and read it if you think this is boring but i need you to understand that during these dates okay going all the way back to 1970 the fed pivot has changed the movement of the market dramatically over 58 percent, sometimes over 40 percent. okay and that's what we are going through now so many of the moves are always driven by the intense examination of the public statements of the federal reserve as soon as they put a statement out there stuff happens in the markets and it's crazy it's, it's a bit like elon musk tweeting all right and actually puts it on there as well so please please do your research on the fed pivot and have a look exactly what i'm talking about Guys, I know this video is a little bit different to what you usually see from us, but I wanted you to understand more about what's going on in the market. So Bitcoin is definitely number one, what I would be buying in December. Number two is XRP. Now we're at 0.38. And what happens is Bitcoin's price is going to start moving up, in my opinion. That's what happens. And then XRP, Ethereum, all the other followers are going to follow up. Once that starts, then you can move on to the altcoins and follow the ride up. I do not see Bitcoin going lower, which makes me believe it's about to start going up which means everything's gonna follow. And the number one is XRP. Now look at what we're at here, okay? We got to an extreme height with XRP before we started coming back down. But in the last three months, we have started seeing green push up, all right? Even in the last month, it has gone down. But then three months is what I like to look at. We've started seeing the push up. So XRP is definitely the second best crypto for me, especially with the court case coming to a close that I think you should be getting involved into. Bitcoin, XRP, getting in color dust average right now, I'm pretty sure we're gonna be okay. There you have it, guys. Please, please keep supporting this channel. I'm super blessed that we get to bring you videos like this every single day. So hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit the bell if you wanna be notified, and I will see you next time.